Welcome to What's New in 2, Airtable's monthly roundup of our latest product updates. I'm your host, Taylor, and I'm excited to dive into these features with you. But first... What's new in two? Creating interfaces just got easier with some new elements. You can now add buttons to your interface so your team members know exactly what they need to do like open a document, or make comments on an asset. You can also add a calendar element to an interface so stakeholders can quickly view this week's deadlines. Finally, you can duplicate both existing elements and interfaces so you have templates to work off of. Next, we're excited to announce Airtable's new integration with Miro, the collaborative whiteboard platform for all of your brainstorming needs. Use frames in Miro to group your items by priority or collaborator giving your data structure. Then, connect your Miro account directly to your base and watch as your brainstorms and notes import into your table as records. You now have everything you need to transform your team's ideas into plans and actionable tasks. The collaborator field is great for assigning ownership to projects and tasks in a base, but there might be situations where teams want to associate individuals with records without giving them base access. You can now reference any user in the collaborator field, even if they're not collaborators in the base. Just add their email. Last but not least are even more updates to help you manage automations. You can now test your entire automation at once, letting you trial run your automation before you send it out to the rest of the team. And if you have a lot of automation set up in your base, you can organize everything into collapsible sections or folders with a simple drag and drop. Thanks for tuning in to May. If you haven't already, hit like and subscribe for more Airtable content.